Okay, welcome back. This dude looked like he was in a tuffle. I was also informed that this one increases your magic. for paladine. Well, don't you say that. That's my worst aspect. You know it's not time for firebombs? Oh! 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 <laughs> ah! Ah! Why is climbing not saving me? Okay. First of all, Al. Second, do I have to? Like, do I seriously have to? Or I could just run back all the way to the beginning spot I was at and, you know, not go through this ordeal? Well, if I'm not one for trying, let's give this parrying thing a go. Harry, he said. Alright. As he winds up, that's when you parry. Ah! Parry's not working! Ow! Kill! Kill! What? Ah! the best. D oh, I didn't drop anything. Well. That hurt. So fuck your message. It's not parry time. It's time to scream louder like a little girl and get behind him and stab him in the butt. Ah, oh, looks like a lot of people died here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Run away! Fuck! I was doing so good. I killed the guy and everything. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. Alright. Fast forward, Josh. You don't have to make them watch me go through this again. Oh, it's been down there. Ugh! Also, I would like people's opinion on um, Nick, my mate, he keeps messages he keeps saying like, Josh, we'll play this game together, and how dare you without me, I'll slit your throat, and all that stuff. And he always ends with, and then we'll end up praising the sun. I don't know what that means in this game. What does praising the sun mean? Is that like the religion? I got no clue. Alright, parry time, or sneak up and stab him in the butt. I trust my strength. Dab in the butt time. You know, I had that faint, faintest little hope in my heart that he wouldn't be here. Like, I would get away scot free. Okay, now I know I'm just fully believing that. Alright, big boy. Let's dance. Fuck is with you, eh? Stab! See, I told you I got good at this game. Embers. Nice. I, I think I know what those do. They give you more health for a little bit. So, 
Saving those for later, obviously. Um, I found the checkpoint above that cat, um, that little spiral area. Yep, above that little knight dude I hate. Seems like everything's going up in the world for Josh. Ooh, a message. What does this say? Not here. Okay. Ah! Ooh, what's the thing over there? Not hear me. So this face. Um, no, no, that that's deaf. My spidey sense is tingling. What's up here? Neat, 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 neat. Ooh, large decrepit corpse. Can I make that jump? They were only no if I try. Well, that was anticlimactic. Not giving that another shot though, I feel like there's another way to get up there. Like, you know, there's a special jump thing. You know, I assume we, we unlock a special Mario-esque jump in this game. By that I mean, extra height! I don't know, I just... Dude, I felt the urges, okay? When a game gives me a destructible environment, I jump at it. Bonfire head, but the way... Be wary of ambushes. Okay. Green Blossom. Uh, Kidoki. This guy's gonna want to get an ambush. Look. Oh! One, two, three, four, all together. The number of the day is four. Ah, 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 ah. Ah. Oh! 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 You sneaky pricks. Well, I know about that now, so that I'm not gonna get surprised ever again. Ooh! Box! Look at this! That's beautiful. Alright, down we go. Or up! Up it is. Oh yeah, I can... See, I'm playing, I'm host, I am a DM for Dungeons & Dragons, if you, if you people who didn't know that. And DM means I'm the master of it. So basically, I run the game for stuff, and we are playing one again on Throwing Knives. I'm actually equip these quickly. Um, so yeah, me and my friends are going to be playing that relatively tomorrow, actually. And uh, I can talk about my plan. And um, get back with you guys and see how accurate that plan was. Because, you know, half of DMing is planning and the other half is improv. Because, you know, when you're like, I want them to go talk to this person. They do everything but talk to that person. Hello, axe-footing man. So, what? Last off, we left them. Left them. Um. There. Okay. Okay. Hey! Stop that. Alright. Um. Gotta keep talking. Last off, I left them. They were on a boat to this island. Come on, just gotta keep talking. So I left them off there on this, um, on this boat heading towards an island that I had made that Fuck you, dog. That they would have to hunt down some monsters part to a joy and adventuring guild that I made up. Because to me it doesn't make sense that they could just buy magical items they wanted. So, yes. They're on an the island, they picked the monsters about they're gonna fight, they chose a basilisk and bone devil. They didn't choose them, it was randomized. Yep. They're heading towards the island. They're going to get to the... This is my plan. See how it goes. Is for them to get to the island. Meet up on the island. They will get 24 hours to collect any intel on the island if they want. Or any other things. They might get into some other mischief there. 
get to the main um, person who will inform them that they will have to um... ah fuck fine um, you know they will all be going out at the same times and find the monsters see but there is a little hints I've given to them oh cool we're back at this place neat little hints I've given them like um well one of the all right they fe they did a quiz they answered a puzzle see if you can answer the puzzle yourself I'll leave the um, answer in the description the puzzle was um well it wasn't a puzzle it was a riddle the riddle was what do you keep when you need it not but throw away when you do need it and eventually after an hour of arguing and just different rambling spews they answered the question and um, two drawers opened up in a desk. One of them had three magical items, which <laughs> they, they're very weary of because I've been cursing them lately. Very fun. And um, two notes describing the monsters and giving them a little bit of intel. Now, on these notes, if they pick up on this, there are uh, on the bottom of the notes, there is two hints written in two different languages. I'm pretty sure it's Elvish and Draconic. If they decipher these clues, I can't mention it because Nick watches these videos and I don't want him getting enough of hand. If they decipher these clues, they will have an advantage on having to figure out how to kill the monsters or any special intel on them. I'm going to go get a health potion. And then I'll try and kill that guy. So yes, on the page, if they can decipher these words, if they speak the language of the fights when they can, they will get hints. How are they going to do that? No, because they're going to forget about it straight away. They've also forgotten about the map Jake had. I can't make that any more of a hint than it already is. <laughs> but yeah, I'll, I'll head you guys up if anything actually happens in the episode that I've not planned. Which is going to be very likely. Well, this is a good spot to leave in that episode. Well, I kill that asshole in the next video. Alright, see you later guys. Bye! <laughs>